reincarnation of domination. Welcome to the Incarnation of Domination here, live on YouTube. Every week, a Heart Foundation member chooses a superstar, and Mark surprises us with that superstar. We talk about our favorite version of that superstar. Mark, what do we got? It's a fun one. Uh, Clint Sacamano, who is also the guy who makes gear and is making my FWF gear, but he... Oh, yeah. Clint! What up, Clint? Clint he is actually says, making something for me as well. Oh, nice. Favorite figure with cosplay gear. Like, as in Rey Mysterio with the Batman gear or Gaga- Gargano are you with the wolf. To with me, Mark? Are you trying <laughs> to get me fired? Uh, man, the first one popped in my head was Sean as Hogan. Does that count? <laughs> that's always been my like favorite. I mean, that's an incredible figure. How does that not count? It do- no, it does. I'm that's one of those more- ones where like you collect Jack's figures and you have no expectations for them because they cut corners and do lazy yeah. shit all the time. But that was like that and the Cena. From the music video? Oh, with the wig? With the wig, like you were like, wow. The bad man, put, right? Yeah, you like they yeah, bad man scene. They put like extra effort into those where you're like sh- pleasantly surprised. Uh that I, and I, I, I just love that meant, feud and everything. I don't know. I thought you meant more of like superhero. I think that like, counts. Yeah, but that's that counts. Cosplaying as Hulk Hogan. Yeah. True. Um, um of course. So Mysterio the, just had that that silver surfer one. <laughs> really well, there's bad. the Mattel one, but yeah. then there's also the Jacks. Makes I think two different versions of it, right? Or is at there least just one? one. There's like a two uh, two pack from that. It was that SummerSlam 07 when he works Chavo. Oh, maybe there's only one. I thought there was two. And we had a talent meeting after where they told us never to spray paint our body silver, which I was like <laughs> one of the first times when you're like, really? We didn't have a meeting for this? Like, who else would, would have done, <laughs> done that? But, but Ray always has cool Toyota gear. Oh, for years and he's been doing it. He he has a like an avatar. One that made it to Mattel. It's I think it's a Toys R Us figure. Yep. Where it has like Toys the braid in the back. Elite. Does it have the yeah, braid? Toys R Us Elite exclusive. Yeah. Does the That's figure cool. actually have the braid or no? Mm, that I can't tell you, but it, it's got like the skin tone with the different right. tones of blue and stuff. Yeah. Um, I know Kofi has got like a He Man figure, He Man style one, Battle he's Cat ske- maybe. He's got Skeletor, oh, it, Battle oh, Cat. Oh, and a Skeletor? He has. He's a Slimer. Slimer. Yeah, he's got Slimer yeah. gear that made it. Um, I'll tell this story now. I had Ghostbuster gear made, and I tweeted it, and Bill McKenna said, if you wear this, I'll make a figure. So I said, okay, cool, because I was saving it for like Halloween season, and it was Halloween season. So I wore it on Raw, and I got to the back, and Triple H pulled me aside, gave me the whole, like, you can't be wearing this, we're going to get sued, blah, 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 blah. And then what do you know, coincidentally, the figure doesn't come out. Now, I don't know if like anything, you know, kabuki-ish went down, but years later, I was able to get my hands on the the prototype. So it made it to the prototype I mean, stage. We, we can post a picture right now. And the full-blown Ghostbuster WWE Masham like, line came out years oh, later. But, but at that time, oh, I know, I'm just Mattel saying. was making Ghostbusters. Yeah. Um, and clearly when those Mashems came out. And then one of the figures that... It, we never saw the light of day. I've never seen a photo of it. Even if it made it to the render stage, I never saw it. Was that before we got released, I was supposed to have the Mania basic. And then the Chase was supposed to be me in the Ghostbuster gear. That's the, like a different version of Ghostbuster gear. Mm. But I never saw the light of day because we got released. Actually, mine got canceled before I got released because I didn't resign the contract. Yes. Yeah. Wait, and that was one with like slimery slime or something. Yeah, yeah. Like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then when I found out, oh, that was a that was a horrible day at the office when I found out that <laughs> it got canceled. Horrible because day I, at the office. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh. I found out that they weren't gonna make it because I didn't resign. Got it. But but then I got cut anyway, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, back on track here. What what's another? Example? Kofi has something where he's like, kind of like Batman esque. Yes. Or is that Ray who's Batman esque? Both. Oh, they're both. Yeah. Okay. Um, they're really yeah. the only. They're the two in the industry, and I guess Gargano has a lot. Gargano oh, is that Wolverine Seth, one? Seth's Deadpool stuff I really liked. Doesn't Seth, he have? Does he have an X Men one? And he has a uh, uh, Thanos has the, one, right? Is it Thanos? And I think he also has a, a Lord of the Rings one. Well, Seth has done a ton, but like, what made it to figures? I think. Yeah. I think. 
the Deadpool one. Oh, I'm think I'm thinking of him being Rey Mysterio from Halloween Havoc. That oh. just came out. That just came out in the summer. <laughs> yeah, that's like Deadpool. That's, I know, I know. Yeah. No, but does doesn't I'm pretty sure that he has a figure of the Game of Thrones one, and he definitely has one of the Thanos one. The Thanos one for sure. It's yeah. like a base it's a basic though or something. It's um, not not so hot. The problem is the, pro- the problem I was just gonna say is that these get crazy deco cuts cut. because of copyrights and stuff like that. Right. Like the Gargano one, that X Men one or whatever, that Wolverine one, you know, you can squint and see like the blue and yellow and be like, Oh, it's you know, X Men themed, but right. to see that real gear that he wore, which was pretty incredible, is very chopped up in its figure form for legal reasons. I don't know if Seth's Chicago Bears <laughs> uniform that counts. One, oh yeah, that one's cut down big time for sure. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any others. I mean, I know personally this is not figure related. Like, I love trying to include stuff, but I, you, I always want to like walk the fine line because what in my head I'm thinking, well, if they make a figure, I want it to be accurate. So I never want to have something that they couldn't put on a figure. There's you know what I'm saying? Shout outs and tributes in all my gear, but it's of other wrestlers, not like pop culture and stuff. I can't even think of one. I will say, spoiler alert. I don't think I've ever done one pop culture. Third time's a charm. I'm going for that Ghostbusters look at Bound for Glory. So I'm hoping I get a fake. Th- <laughs> All right, I'm really rooting for you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Different oh, different man. gear, but Ghostbuster-esque. Um, I'm going to text them more and tell them that <laughs> you don't own the rights to it. Well, it Ghostbuster-esque. Yeah, gotcha. Um, let's see. When I, when I beat I mean, Chris I wore Jericho, Jet, New York Jets-esque. Gear That's true. When, okay, when that we uh, won the tag team titles, that counts. Mm. Mm. Uh, I'm trying to think. Like, there's CM Punk's out there where he's as Macho Man and as as uh, yeah, those are the wrestlers, but not like pop yeah. culture, movie, comic books. And, yeah. and you know what the problem is too is like I'm not such a comic book fan. Where if there is a figure out there, I you might don't even not realize. know it. Well, yeah. yeah, me and Mackenzie have been watching Spidey and his oh, amazing friends. I have, I have a great so. one. What about WrestleMania 20, Rey Mysterio as the Flash? They make a Jax, and they make a ringside. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I yeah. love that one. Yeah. That was really, it's really a very, cool. very rare ringside. I believe it's the first. I think it's the first Mattel ringside exclusive, correct? Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Pretty, will cost you a pretty penny. Um, I'm trying to and say. Then there's, is there like a G.I. Joe CM Punk? Like G.I. Joe-esque? Or is that just gear that he had made? I think it's just gear. I think it's debatable. Um, there's got to be like... There's more I mean, that we're missing. It's really Kofi and Ray that Well, I think Alexa Bliss, Alexa Bliss does it a lot too. But I, have I, they I, not made them in fit? Like their Buzz Lightyear gear never saw a figure. I don't, I don't know which ones. I know she's had like Freddy Krueger gear. I don't know which has made the figure. You're Chucky. Right, right. Yeah. Um, I think oh, it's, oh, no. There was no figure. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. that? It was... Um, I can't even think of her name. Never mind. <laughs> but it didn't make a figure. So there's a lot of people that do it, but it's whether or not they get to the figure part. Right. Um, Cody. Does it? I'm sure Cody does. Oh, cool Star stuff. Trek. Star Trek The Chase from Jazzwares. Oh, there you go. There's a Cody Star, right there. Star Trek Cody. You're right. So there's a lot of there's a lot of cool people to do because the, the thing is like, well, uh, Hurricane's nope. a goddamn superhero. You know, like <laughs> it's just the legality of using right. the stuff and being very very creative to make you know yes so i'm sure we've missed a couple cool. but those are the ones off the top of still, our head it's still fun cool. it, uh, uh sean as hulk is still my number one that counts. yeah me too yeah mine is the the time that mattel uh made us the forky ghostbuster figures <laughs> actually i'm gonna change mine to the silver surfer <laughs> ray because i it makes me laugh when i see it why this is ridiculous looking figure. The basic, the, the, the basic, the basic. That's literally just silver, like no effort or. It looks like you take a detail. figure and just dropped it in like silver yeah. nail polish. No, nope. yeah, the, 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 the Jax, if I recall, has like where it tones where it looks yes, like yes. it's paint. Yeah. Uh, mine is. I'm looking at it right now. Mine is the unreleased Zack Ryder Ghostbuster figure because I know that it got to that stage at least, got and I have far. it. So I think it's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. cool. All right. All right. I love the Mojo Raleigh where he's in wrestling gear cosplaying as a pro wrestler. (laughs) All right. Mark, Mark, you can leave that in. Yeah.